Hello guys, welcome back. This is my 30 uh, PHP tutorial and in this video I supposedly uh, told you that we would start doing the search engine uh, the search engine uh, to search the database in our website or our CRUD test site but uh, before we do that search engine I want to uh, change some things here in the register form and you know that uh, when you do any forms at all you have to confirm the password right uh, normally when you register to a web page you have password at the end and then you have something saying confirm password okay or type your password again to confirm it so I'm gonna do that in our uh, form so to start doing that we have to type a new input in the form so let's go to form.php and type tr and uh, td with and basically we are typing the same thing that we have in the other uh, lines okay so now we type confirm table data open table data input type equals password as well and in the name here we type instead of password as we did here above we have to give uh, have to give it another name so let's type C password okay and close that close table data and uh, close table row and that's it let's save this let's see the result here and there it is okay so we have now we have a uh, name input, the email input, the password input, and the confirm password input. Okay, so what we need now is to make sure that whatever we type in here has to be the same uh, that we type in here. Okay, and that way the password will be confirmed as a valid password. Okay. So we have to change a little bit the code here uh, in uh, the insert.php. So let's go there. And to start, we have to get the variable uh, post C password. Okay, have to get the value that we type in here, and we get that with the name here C password. So first, let's create C password oops c password variable and the value uh, of that variable is the value that we pass through the c password input in the form that we post and now in here after we confirm that we have a name, an email, and a password. Uh, after password, we also want to confirm that we type the C password. So let's type C password. Okay. And in here, we're going to type a new if statement saying if password equals exactly to C password. do this uh, or run this code here basically run the whole code and in here after echo you successfully registered we have to close the um, the condition this condition here so I'm gonna type I'm gonna put this a little bit organized
here, here, and this here, and this here, here, and a little bit, this one here, here, or here, and the cells here, here, and this here, include here. And now what I want is to uh, have another else statement here. Okay. So if you are a little bit confused and you lost the where we were after the echo you have successfully registered have to type the close bracket that belongs to the this if statement here password equals to password and here type else after closing bracket open and close another bracket and in here type echo and inside we have to type an echo message okay so echo a message saying that uh, if password which is the first uh, password input is not equal to confirm password what do we want to the message to be so if it's not equal echo um, your passwords don't match okay and uh, basically that's it save that and let's go back to the register form refresh so let's see if it works name let's give a new name saying uh, let's say Billy uh, email you can type Billy hotmail.com whatever email you want password 123 and let's say confirm password 122 okay so this is the first password we type 123 and in here we type 122 to see if um, our um, script uh, works okay we should have uh, a message saying your passwords don't match okay let's register and that's it it works perfectly okay guys so the passwords don't match we have to go back and type one two three and now one two three as well confirm and now it should work and the register should be able to register successfully register you have registered successfully and of course if you go to the user at the bottom we have Billy registered with the Billy uh, hotmail.com and the password 123 okay guys so this is how it works and this is how we make um, the script to work with a confirmed password input so see you guys in the next video and yes in the next video um, I promise you guys that we will start doing the the script to uh, build our search engine uh, into uh, to search our database okay so see you guys in the next video bye